Uh, hey guys, Trevor Christian Mayweather today with, and we're back with Evangelion episode 19. You know what, after the last episode, the last episode was fantastic. Um, I'm glad some of you cleared up that um, the reason they didn't kill, kill him off is to do with censorship at the time, like apparently he does die in the manga. It would have been so much more impactful if he died in that scene and then Sinji screaming. Bigger effect. It's still going to have the same effect. They've just done what they've done is just kept him alive, but I'm guessing they just pretty much retcon him out of the story after that but i'm glad you told me the censorship because it just makes me more understandable towards it good development for the character not good development but some down a lot of um down inspiring development for some of the characters and uh, the way sinji screamed at the end was so good and it makes me excited to see what he's going to do this episode hopefully in a good tube in the stick hans did bring up two questions of discussion and i do want to discuss them one of them i was thinking about um after i watched the episode for quite a while is sinji's dad being a, was he being an asshole with what he did and that's a hard question, like, because I don't know what his end goal is and what he's actually trying to protect, he did the right thing in the sense that Sinji wasn't going to attack and Sinji was just being very passive and didn't want to fight. I think Sinji was in the wrong... Sinji being too passive, like, Sinji could have beat the uh, beat the mecha without killing it, without killing the driver. He just needed to rip it off and disable it, but he was just so adamant not attacking it because he was seeing the whole thing as human instead of just he could just beating the outside and ripping out the internal so I think like Sinji was in the wrong there but it also the dad could have st I don't know if the dad could have once he's put that dummy in placement could he have stopped it could he have like um, stopped it going as bad shit as did once it ripped off a few arms or is he just interested to see how far it would go they're, they're both in the wrong but at the end of the day he, he had to he had to activate the dummy Sinji wasn't fine I don't think unlike Miso I, he doesn't have the connection with Sinji to talk him into it Whereas, like, say Miso was in charge, I think she could have talked Shinji into fighting back and maybe convinced him that, oh, Shinji, you need to disarm it, disable it, think about that, and I bet he would have done. But that's the that's just the difference in the relationships of the two characters. So the dad did what he thought was best. But like I said, he's an arsehole for what he did, but understandable. And the thing he brought up was... Um, that um, Hans brought up again is Asuka. Asuka not telling Sinji. I didn't really think about that, but yeah. Um, he mentioned, uh, is it, did she not tell him because she cared about Sinji the same as me, Miso? Miso? Or did she just do it for her own selfish, to keep the, the fact herself? I think it's a bit of both. I think she didn't want to tell him because she cared, but I also think she did sort of want to have that information over Sinji, that like she, like she knows something over him, so just like give her empowerment. I would say, I would say that would be the case with Asuka. It's a bit of both, I think. Deep down she cares, but outwardly, I think it was like, oh, she knows something he doesn't, I'm not gonna inform you, but it's above me. But I'm not too sure, you could go either way with that. So yeah, I think like Asuka was mainly just doing it for a bit of both. Deep down she cared, down she didn't want to probably tell him, but I think externally, like, yeah, she was um, hiding it to have something above or just have something that someone else doesn't know. Um, yeah, whatever that, just, just kind of, but overall, fantastic episode. And give, please share your thoughts in the guys below. I'm sure I'd be glad to read what you guys think about those two points. But yeah, last episode. But I just want to get to this episode, see where this story's going to take us now. As I don't know, like this, the story's getting dire, and I don't know how they're going to get how they're going to fix the situation. And hopefully, something good will happen soon, and we get a bit of good luck, or it just gets worse <laughs> and more depressing. I'm guessing it's going to get more depressing. But overall, than that, let's get into the reaction. Please like subscribe guys, I try and do this weekly and I'm doing other anime series as well. Let's get into this. Fuck! Sinji! See this would have been so good if like, he died as well. This would have made so oh this would have been so understandable his unstableness. Fucking hell, it's first time we've seen such outward hate from him. I respect his like way to just stay fucking um professional. I really want to know what goes through that dad's mind. <laughs> Easier said than done. I love how they all get pulled into like, this tram. It's like the mind or something, or what they're really thinking. <laughs> oh god, they're actually that threatened by him. Oh, this is your moment, Sinji. Ah, that's not the answer I want you to give. Oh, what goes through that fucking man's head? Oh, 
Erase the third child? Fucking hell. <laughs> Fucking hell. It's deja vu, we're back again. Ooh, fair play. Because they think through everything, don't they? Oh, the look he's given so different. I love it. <laughs> At least this time he was very different from the last one away. Just like his personality change here. Oh, someone's going to get hurt in it now to bring him back. I don't know they have these all around, like they're never going to do anything. Ooh. Fuck, I just went straight through the armor. Fuck. Why do the angels just keep fucking getting stronger and stronger? That makes sense to be fair, but still. He's relying on those dummy pugs a lot, even though they're fucking um, risky as shit. The dummy pugs dangerous for that one. Fuck's sake. She's so dedicated. I love the looks in you gives, they're so different. <laughs> That's a lot of asking for Asuka. She got javelins there. <laughs> Go all the action. The thing is just taking it, mate. Mate, the pressure's slowly getting to her. Oh shit! <laughs> Fuck, he just disabled that. They're sharp then. Fuck. That's going about to get wrecked. Oh shit! Yeah, Asuka won't die this early on. No, it's not even early on, it's sort of late. Fuck, she got absolutely destroyed. That's going to destroy her confidence. Losing again like that. I love how everyone's turning against them as well. They need him. <laughs> Man, do want to take responsibility? <laughs> Oh, our boy's here. Why did he just calmly fucking water on his pants? Oh, it's so weird we're coming near the end of the series. It really feels like it. Oh, that's an explosive. Mate, suicide bombing. Mate, Ray's fucking got dedication, mate. This show definitely knows how to make a dire situation. Oh, the music. Oh. That was well placed. Oh shit! Mate. Why does they both die on top of that? Maybe you can still do something. Probably got there for working, didn't he? Come on, come on. Tell me that to pipe down. Mid to save humanity, mate. Come on. Yes. I was waiting for the fish glance. Mate, this thing's not wasting time. That is terrifying. Oh, boy! Oh, mate. The animation is show can be really good when it wants to. You do forget him. Oh, what a clever bastard. Fuck yeah, getting him out of there. Out in the open, boy. Mate, this is sick. Never seen Sidney go so berserk. That's a crazy look, fuck no. 
Oh, it's power supply. Shit. We're relying on the actual angel now, aren't we? The actual angel's going to fucking just have to go berserk. Come on, this is a nine tail fox moment. Oh, something's going to happen. Fuck that, that Eva can take some damage. Oh, 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 yes, we are getting Nine Tail Fox moment. <laughs> One reason I love anime. <laughs> oh shit, it fucking sliced it. Oh, sit down. Oh, the music's been on point this episode. Oh, is it fucking just adding the tissue to itself? It just gained a hand. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. That went straight through the AT field. The sound effects for the E, but I wonder how they got all of them and made those. Oh, that's so creepy. It's fucking eating it. Fuck. That's some creepy imagery there. I just have to have a human hand, it's creeping me out. Is it fucks going on? Sinjik's still stop with her. Wait, did they want this? Oh, they got an episode that. Oh. I need information. Ah, <laughs> uh, fuck. Oh, I'm in the show. Even this late on throws even more questions at you. Um, fantastic episode. I love that one. Um, I was a bit iffy about Shinji running away again, but I like the look in his eye, and then it, the whole way it led up to him coming back, getting 400% sync rate, was pretty damn savage. It just reminds me of the time when you watch Naruto going on Tail Fox, and it's just berserk state. That was pretty awesome, seeing this very creepy, the, when the Eva's like that, oh, fuck me. That's creepy. Good interactions between... Shinji did a good job there, coming back, and I like the way he did it. He just did it. I like the way they did it. It didn't feel as it didn't feel like he ran away like last time. Cause last time he ran away because he was like didn't want to be there, scared or whatever. Too much pressure at that time. Was just more like he was sick of his dad and what they were doing. And then he came back because he's like, me, I'm the only one could do it, and my friends and that lot. And he was a bit more angry. It's nice to see Sinji angry. That's a rare sight we don't see very often. Um, other than that, Asuka, she's going to be f no matter what. After this fight, Asuka's ego is going to be gone. Like not gone, like gone, but she's going to go probably. Really down a dark path after losing twice and looking maybe a little pathetic. And then you had a really little sacrifice there as well. And overall, a lot happened in that episode, and there's surely a lot to talk about. But I do need to get this edited and uploaded. So, otherwise, guys, fantastic episode. Thanks for watching this with me, and I hope to see you next week. Peace.